Has Taylor Swift moved on to a new boyfriend already? Mm. That's the rumor. You know, just, uh, I don't even know, a I, I, month, a month maybe? Taylor Swift mm-hmm. and her boyfriend of six years, Joe Alwyn, broke up. And now Taylor Swift is reportedly madly in love with the 1975 frontman, Matty Healy. What? I used to judge such things, but you know what? Yeah? She's in love with love and yeah. go for it. I think yeah. two wow. things that happen sometimes. I think for, the first thing is it's been, it's, it's, it's kind of like you're in this relationship and it's not going well. And then all of a sudden you get out of it and the grass is greener mm-hmm. at first on the oh. other side. And it's like, oh my gosh, what was I missing? I'm so in love. And of course, in six years, you can ask that question. It might be different, right? Mm-hmm. It should be somebody else. Mm-hmm. And the other que- uh, thing that could possibly have happened is the last year or two for them, they could probably were just kind of going along going with the it motions. And, yeah. not, yep. and just didn't want to announce anything. Yeah. Oh, the honeymoon period was over for years and years and years. Totally. I mean, they were in the middle of buying a house, Taylor Swift and Joe yeah. Alwyn, oh. uh, in London. But I don't know the status of that house and the status of the sale anymore. Mm-hmm. I'm assuming it's not going forward. Yeah. I'm assuming. I don't know. But, I hope the person um, got their earnest money. <laughs> <laughs> they, did, they did too. Do they even have to do that, big time celebrities? No. Like, well, I don't know if I can do that much earnest money. I don't think so. I think that they're just, they just, just say, here's it. my wad of cash. Yeah, here, yeah. Here's my name. Yeah. Oh, okay. Or they say, hey, Tina, buy that house for me. <laughs> right. And then their assistant handles it. Uh, you, uh, correct. Mm-hmm. Um, but a friend that's very close to Taylor Swift says, oh, it's in the early days, but it just feels right. By the way, not the first first time that Taylor Swift and Maddie Healy have been together. They dated oh. um, one time before, very briefly, almost 10 years ago. It was a one night stand. It might have been. Might have been. And I guarantee when he, sh- he and maybe before, you never mm-hmm. know with people, but let's just say he saw, oh, broken up, texted her right away. Could have been. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, if you want to catch up. That's his in. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I guess that the same friend is saying, you know, they've been broken up. Kind of just what we were saying about how you're just going through the motions and maybe they didn't want to announce anything, saying there is not any crossover. It's not the reason that she and Joe I broke see. up. Right. Um, mm. Both Maddie and Taylor have been touring over the past few weeks. So it's been a lot of FaceTiming and texting, but she cannot wait to see him again. And he's hooking up with other girls while he's touring. It's great. And then, mm-hmm. Oh, face him. Oh, I miss you so much. Right. And the other girl. Yeah. yeah. And uh, Go also. In the bathroom and shut up. I'm going to face down. Screw this. You've done that before. Have you? Have you done that? No. Um, somebody. <laughs> a friend of mine used to refer to this behavior, you know, like the guy who is there for you the second that you break up. Yeah. As a hyena. Ooh, yes, I like to that. refer to oh, those yeah. guys as yes, <laughs> just like <laughs> waiting, waiting in the wings yep. for mm-hmm. you know what to hit There's the fan. Stock, it's happening. I guarantee today. Mm-hmm. There's men and women stalking social media profiles totally like, for somebody that they may have had interest in, but they respect the fact they're with somebody, mm-hmm. and they say, "Oh, profile picture doesn't have the husband in it or the wife in it." Right. Mm-hmm. Oh, they're posting oh, a lot of memes oh. about uh, sadness relationships, mm-hmm. and boom. Oh yeah. Just right like away. earlier, we had some yeah. lady Constance. Oh, she yeah. just called it out of the blue. We don't know who she is. Mm. We're even talking anything about us. Well, she wasn't. She, the, the, the difference is that I was. I'm still together, though. That's, no, that's what I'm saying. But she's like she's letting this it be is known. the exact example. Yeah, she's waiting in the wings. Mm-hmm. She called in. We don't know her, and, and now, she said Jason. She didn't even know his name. Yeah, the guy's voice. She must be new to the show. The guy who just said the thing that sounded stupid. I think sounds hot. Mm-hmm. And said, "Oh, he's married." She's like, "I don't care." Yeah. I don't wow. care. Now so we she know her name. She's going to start stalking your social media thing. <laughs> yeah. And if they're, and I heaven forbid, there's trouble in paradise. Boom, Constance. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Same for Katie. One of Squid's but friends. Come in. Oh, yeah. When they come in, are they uh, guys? Is it more effective? Maybe this is a question for Katie in the past. Yeah. Is it more effective for a guy to go in being like, oh, I'm sorry to hear that if you just you need anybody to, you know, to, you know, get out or get away with? Is, is that approach better or a better approach is like, oh, you're not broken up? I got to take you out, that type of thing. Man, I would assume for both men and women, the better approach is to be there at, when they're at their most vulnerable. Right, mm-hmm. right. You know? I'm saying, but, but what approach is it like, oh, I just, this is so terrible for you. Like, you need do, someone to do talk you pretend, to. Do you pretend that you're upset that they broke up? Right. Or are you kind of oh, like. Oh, I don't even think you have to do that. I think you just show interest. Yeah. yeah. You know, but, I but don't think you, you. But you say, I am yeah. sorry you're going through that, and then let you say. Oh, he was a jerk right. or whatever. And you're like, oh, I, yeah. And then, like, if you ever want to, you know, 
Get out of the house. No, I, I it, more of on a friend. Friend, because yeah. I know you're mm-hmm. feeling down. Right. That manipulation or the. Or you send a D pic right away. Just, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Don't do that. Okay. Ever. Okay. <laughs> right. Ever. Or, no matter the situation. Like, oh, well, you know, and just ask out. Like, because sometimes, yeah, yeah. sometimes girls the will be like, they're, they're, yeah. they're not ready for dating at that point. So don't. you have to do the manipulation part. No. Of, yeah, I just want no. to be there don't for do you. I think don't do that. I think with anything, do you that. have to craft what you say uh, in a certain way. You can craft it, but don't play the, oh, he was no good for you. D- no. Don't just talk don't. About, just don't, don't, don't talk about him. him. Don't no. talk about him. No, we don't, we don't want to talk and about him. And neither do they, probably. But if, if, if they start to, you're like, I'm just really sorry you went through that. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah. You know, like, let's go out. but, you know. Yeah, let's go out and grab a couple beers. I mean, I'll be that way in a few months. But right now, I'm a good guy. <laughs> but do you know what I mean? Yes. Just let's go grab a couple beers. Squid, what'd you say? It was the mini slide? What'd you say? I was saying, like, do you mean, like, uh, as far as that, try to slide in averagely, like a normal DM, a normal, like, you know, yeah. slide in DM, a normal slot, or, like, you know, make it, like, uh, more manipulative as far as what Jason was don't saying. Manipulate. A, so yeah. you don't manipulate. You said it's a mini slide? It's, you're, well, you're, if you want no, to I, I hook up with a person, manipulate. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I, was, I was just trying to clarify what Jason was getting oh, at. Oh, I do know when, um, years ago, when me and Heather... We were got, we were separated. Yeah. And I announced it. I did have, I, I had some women, mm-hmm. and they all approach it in a very kind way. And at first, I was like, you know, I didn't know what was going on. Uh-huh. Separated. When you're separated, you can date or whatever. But, um, and they were like, um, hey, I heard your announcement on the air. I'm really sorry about that. If you ever need someone to talk to, and at first, because I was naive, I'm like. Thank you so much. That's blah, so blah, blah. nice. Then I realized, oh, they want to go out, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. which is flattering. Mm-hmm. Believe it or not, there's people who showed interest in me as a human being. And did, and you, did you have your photo on the profile? No, I had them all scrubbed. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was, it was just a recording. cartoon. Yeah, it play on. <laughs> From on air. I actually did see some photos of me about eight or nine years ago when all that mm. happened. I'm like, dang, I'm starting to look more like Luke Combs. <laughs> <laughs> But <laughs> not good. Yeah. Oh, not good. Mm-hmm. Not good. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, social media has made this so easy for all of you hyenas. <laughs> yeah. Because oh, before yeah. you actually had to know the status of people's relationships in person. Mm-hmm. Or being oh, yeah. or being their friend. Group. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Like I used to like when a girl would get a boyfriend that I like, I would unfollow her because like I'm not your per- your pictures are worthless now. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and, then, but then, and then like once once like the, the, the rumor would get around she broke up, I go to her profile, I'm like no pictures of the guy. Yes, we follow her back. <laughs> follow her. I don't know what happened. I don't because yeah. then, then you send it like an Instagram request for the friend, and they're like, "Oh I thought yeah, we're already friends." Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, then, yeah. You're, then you're like, "I have no idea what happened." I don't know. I don't know. I reconnected. I'm so worried about you. <laughs> <laughs> um, by the way, Taylor Swift. This is all because Taylor Swift is is allegedly head over heels with a guy that she once dated, the, the 1975 frontman, Matty Healy. They dated mm-hmm. once 10 years ago. Now, apparently, they're back together. But Taylor Swift was also just rumored to be seeing F1 driver Fernando Alonso. Wow. Mm. Who's also, of course, good looking. Yeah. She's not going to date a scrub. I wonder if she's ever going to get married. I don't know. She's 33. She's okay. got all the time. You know what okay. I mean? And a um, six year relationship. That's a big one. That's for a that, long time. For that mm-hmm. age. It's like a big portion of her adult life. For sure. Um, in other news, Gwyneth Paltrow. We I mean, I'm telling you, Gwyneth has been on fire this year. Mm-hmm. We've talked more about Gwyneth and her previous relationships. But anyway, uh, Gwyneth Paltrow just revealed you want to talk about awkward. Talking about her past boyfriends and then talked about how they rank. As lovers. Ooh. Mm. Mm-hmm. Actually, mm. naming names, talking about how each one was in the bedroom. Wow. Okay, we're gonna play a game. Okay. Brad or Ben? It'll be fun. Who was better in bed? Brad. Ben with who? Affleck. Affleck. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. I don't know why I didn't know that. Brad was like the sort of major chemistry love of your life, and then like Ben was like technically excellent. <laughs> In bed. Wow. Wait, 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 wait. Mm-hmm. So, so she's basically saying that Brad Pitt was more of a love maker and Ben was more of a Here doer. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, <laughs> yes. I think uh, that it's like Brad Pitt is you're just so in love with who he is. Like, no matter what you're, with what him, yeah. you're doing, mm-hmm. you know, it's just every. It's very passionate. Lots of eye contact. Eye contact, mm-hmm. sensual, sexual, mm-hmm. right? But that Ben Affleck did everything right yeah. by the book. And what do Sex most machine. women mm-hmm. prefer? A combo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they want it all. I need a combo. <sighs> Gotta have everything. Yep. <laughs> Squid, you just can't just be a sex machine. <laughs>
Can't just be uh, Brad Pitt. To give yeah. him the curse. <laughs> you gotta also be Ben Affleck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> gotta be Bob Bob. <laughs> gotta be Ben Affleck and, and Pitt. Um, I will say, no, th- let me take that back. I will say, when married, I want the combo. Yes. When just dating or hooking up, I want a Ben Affleck. Yeah. yeah. You know? okay. So mm-hmm. you I prefer, you. overall then, percentage-wise, a smaller percentage of the sensual. Yeah, because that is what I share with my husband. And Do you know what I mean? You also want your built husband in, to, right? yeah. to be like this attacker type thing. Well, I want a little bit of that too okay, in my husband. Got it. Yeah. So we're going to go around the room and uh, rank our former sexual partners. Jason Goodman, you go first. <laughs> first Jason Goodman, we're out of time for one. We'll start with Jason. <laughs> yeah. We may not get to everyone else. And then we're going to call our spouses. <laughs> we'll and then Jason. they can. Jason first. And again, we may run out of time before we get to anyone else. <laughs> Jason? <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Yeah, Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. He's like, all right, at number 241 <laughs> was Trish when I was 17. Okay. <laughs> At 240. Oh, jeez. Wow. <laughs> Can we start with the top 10? They're naming all the things. <laughs> that would be officially our last day on the radio. Because oh, yeah. all of our spouses or significant others would be like, we're done. Yeah. We'll, we're killing <laughs> well, you. I think, uh, I'm sure every one of us would have to say, if we're with somebody, uh, we would have to say that they're the number one, right? We, whether, I think we're what, lucky if we get to say they're number one. Well, well, it, <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, yeah. I think it's... Yeah, true. We have to... Whether we think that or not, we have to say that. That's you have to say it. I see. Because yes. you're going to be trouble in paradise. I mean, yeah. in my case, Ben is my best. Oh, so there's really? That. Mm-hmm. Wow. So mm-hmm. You told me. I'm kidding. That I'm, is kidding. Not I'm true. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That's I'm the kidding. only reason you went corporate because <laughs> 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 you realize the corporate men can do it better. <laughs> <laughs> she liked that young Republican love. <laughs> He's ben got like the sensual <laughs> and the technical. <laughs> <laughs> All of it. Corporate. And he can do your taxes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what he looks like. Very yeah. professional. <laughs> <laughs> like he yeah. looks like someone that wouldn't even enjoy sexy time because he's so busy just being <laughs> focused on numbers, being white collar. Too know? many numbers. I don't yeah. know what his stars. deal is. He would want to set uh, a conference call <laughs> 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 at exact time, right? A, a uh-huh. Exact procedure, yeah. right? Of of when we are going to do the intimacy. <laughs> and Let me check my calendar. I don't yeah. know. That might be how he, he looks, looks, but yeah. the way he acts, I don't know what has gotten into him lately. Like we are ready have a great active life, right? I mean, wow. I don't talk about it, but for the past like 6 months, I don't know. Really? Just Boy. Like a and like what is wild what is rabbit that? animal. <laughs> like how is it more often? Yes. Like wow. how like, often are you saying a week now? Okay, do you remember oh, probably probably on average, I would say 4. Wow. Not even kidding. Wow. And remember when I told you that I had this big revelation about yeah. how I always thought that Ben enjoyed sleeping mm. like like on the farthest end of the bed like yeah, right, so yeah. so far away from me i couldn't in our in the king bed couldn't even like get, a, get reach away from, him, right yeah, i yeah. thought that i took it very personally yeah and then he said no because every time you know the reason i sleep over there is because every time our bodies are touching you sweat all he over. wants to no oh. he wants to and Boy. i was like really oh really mm-hmm. yes and he said that's well, why i do that because otherwise like, you have to get up or he was actually being really respectful and nice and kind and now we don't do that, and so uh, he's right. It's on, boy. Yep. Wow. And that's yep. like a, a really slick brag on Katie's part. If you For what? Yeah. It, she's like, if he touches my body, he has to have it. <laughs> right? <Yeah. laughs> he can't even touch it. <laughs> he can't, if he's within six or seven inches, it's on. <laughs> it just happens. I'm that irresistible. <laughs> I didn't even mean it that way. I just, wow. it's like, it was a revelation. I, that's you great. You know, I was even taking it, it personally, mm, and great. I didn't have to. Well, you're getting some exercise in. True that. And This watch uh, has been going off like wow. crazy. <laughs> Four yeah. times a week on average now. I real, I'm serious. What about you, Jason? Not that much. Yeah. No, not that mm-hmm. much. Maybe I like mean, two. Uh, it depends if it's like a, if you make it quick. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Oh. That's not great. I don't like that. No kidding. What about um, you, Matt? Uh, two to three. Wow. wow. I do think this last week it's been down a little bit. I recently got a CPAP. Oh, that, oh, that, that oh, was so, right. so yeah, I'm, I'm not as attractive Vader? right now yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to myself or her. Have you uh, guys? You need to go to uh, <laughs> Sleep Med Solutions and get yeah. rid of that CPAP. Have you done it? With the CPAP on. Absolutely not. No. Uh, no. no. You should do some like oh, Darth Vader role play. Yeah, sure. yeah. Like Bane from Batman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I would have break your pelvis. <laughs> <I'll> just, <laughs> maybe with just the, oh. but I can't do it with the hose. I will <laughs> choke to death with the hose. I don't know what y'all do in your bedroom uh. with hoses or whatever, but that's fine, Matt. <laughs> 
<laughs> just the the hose because when the hose is connected, I, if I turn the, any direction, it's gonna ch- go around my neck, and choke me. Well, maybe that's uh, kind of hot. Well, you, you, can, you, can, yeah. you can role play that. I'm on my deathbed and we need it one last time, baby. Let, please let her wear. It. <laughs> yeah. We've got ideas for you. Let Matt. her wear the mask. Okay. I'm gonna pitch these at dinner. Okay. <laughs> See how please. It goes. Yeah. yeah. Please just don't say they came from us because that's weird. <laughs> And then film it, let us see it. What? <laughs> no, that's bizarre. The show thinks you should wear my mask. <laughs> it's for the show content. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I'm getting gaslighted sexually. What yeah? do you mean? Because I'll be like, Kara, well, well, Katie will say that she does it Don't three or four times a week. Don't you dare bring me. Matt will say she does it three or four times a week. Josie says she does it 30 times a week. Uh-huh. <laughs> and she'll be like, they're lying. That's not true. They're just saying that. I'm like, oh, okay. Then we'll be watching. <laughs> we'll be watching a movie as he's putting his pants back on. He's right. like, All right, fine. Then we'll be watching a movie and there's like a sex scene. She's like, I can't stand how the movies are so fake. Like this happens all the time. I'm like, oh, okay. I was thinking in your mind, you're thinking, oh, maybe this could lead to yeah. lead to that, it. That mm-hmm. makes me feel good. That makes now. me feel sad for you. Mm, I I'm not liking that. I'm not lying. I know you're not. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, Katie I before has said, oh, you know, two or whatever. But yeah, yeah. I mean, and oh. definitely, we went six whole months after I well after I had yeah, a baby, baby. But yeah. then even I was like. Mm, Six months, but then I immediately, right. lucky enough, but immediately to get pregnant right away. <laughs> Jason, <laughs> oh, Jason, have right. you broken in the hot tub yet? Uh, no, not like that because what? Uh, oh, man, oh, you really are struggling. It's overrated. You are priority. I don't no, you can like do like on the side or whatever. water. Yeah, I don't like the water part. But and still. second of all, I spent, I have spent seriously. 50 hours cleaning this damn high maintenance thing for a while. <laughs> I can't figure out the chemicals right. You're talking, so about, Carol, you're talking about Carol the hot tub. The tub yeah. <laughs> I, I, I make sure I'm very strict about chemicals. who gets in <laughs> because I don't feel like having the, the hot tub phone up and I have to deal with the crap. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you make people shower before they get to. in? Oh, I man. want them to. Yeah. sign up next to it, shower before entering. I want them to because you your oil, especially women, the oils mm. and the makeup mess up the water. Oh, oh man. Jason. Well, we just learned this week that Jason carries around his yard a decibel meter mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. to make sure he's checking the noise decibels and to make sure he's not <laughs> affecting his neighbor. I yeah. think I know why your wife doesn't want to sleep with you. <laughs> I think I get it. Thank you, Katie. Yeah. She's like, I'm not clean enough. I might make too much noise. You're too oily. <laughs> he also the decibel thing while they're doing like, Carol, too loud. There was a time. <laughs> oh. Uh, Oh. I didn't have a decibel meter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't have much time left. We were loud as can be. Yeah. <laughs> what a week. Yeah. 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 Jason. <laughs> what a week. You know that? What a damn week. <laughs> <laughs> the thing about your hot tub, yeah. <laughs> you don't have to love it. You yeah. just, you know what I mean? Yeah. It, it doesn't have to be something where you're like, oh, I. It's my favorite thing. I, it, yeah, but you it's don't just kind have of something to. different. It's something different, and you're breaking it in, and it's new, and it's fun. It doesn't have to be the best of your whole life. It's just fun. It, it's fun. Maybe yeah. after, I, maybe because I haven't been drinking at the same. Okay. And, it's, yeah. and also the na- it's outside, and my neighbors always there looking over the deck. Oh, that's even more exciting. No, I yeah, think, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Is this like Wilson yeah. from Home Improvement? Uh, yeah, Heidi <laughs> 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 Ho. No, I'm saying you don't want them to watch, but like the the chance of getting caught, I think, yeah. makes it more exciting. Just be quiet. You kind of do want them to watch. Yeah. Are you Mormon? <laughs> it might be Jared. Uh, uh, slip and fall. <laughs> and then, the, then the decibels when he's screaming. Oh, yeah. he's so mad. Would you have said that if you were 18? Uh, oh, I can't do it in the hot tub. I might no. slip and fall. When I'm 18, no. I'm not married for 80 years. Right. Oh. You'd be doing it in a dumpster. Now, Come on. You know what the sad thing is? <laughs> not that this would be me. Let's just put it on Katie. No, <laughs> no, no, no. I'm not the one with the issue. All right, I, for women, though, I guarantee this for women. Like, Probably Carol wouldn't do that right now, just so wanting to and eager. And maybe it will happen, maybe it wouldn't, right? Uh-huh. But I guarantee if she pulled it like a Taylor Swift, well, all of a sudden she has this new guy, oh. they'll be doing it all the time in the yeah. hot tub with oh. the neighbors. And, yeah. It, yeah. yeah. Oh. They'll be yeah. doing it in the front lawn at mm-hmm. noon. Do you want Squid to come over and break in your hot tub for you? <laughs> no, I'm sure you can yeah. bring somebody I'd over. I'd rather not have to drain the thing of herpes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was hurtful. Fake news. That was hurtful. Yeah, that... He's been gaslit, Squid. He's he hurt. Has. Yeah. He's been lashing out. Yeah, yeah. I think what the if... ring gets rid of all that. I think so, too. <laughs> yeah, think so. What if you dressed up as somebody else, pretended like mm. you weren't you? Yeah, mm. like Ben Stiller or something. <laughs> I really feel like if somebody's going out of their way to gaslight me about sex... <laughs> That's a problem, I'm thinking. No, no, about. I'm yeah. saying just pretending, just go, uh, liven things up, you know, freshen it up a little bit. Yeah. yeah. I could be t- like a taller guy. No, no. 
I'm not, oh, I'm I not downing you here. Dress up as an Amazon driver. Boy. Mm. I got oh, a package yeah. for you. Yeah. Special yeah. delivery. Yeah. Open yeah. this package. <laughs> <laughs> Have a hole in the box. Yes, open the box. It's not me. We helped Matt. We're trying to help you. Yeah. Sorry, okay. Just, all right. I'll just continue to have this week. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe just this week. Yeah. Maybe, Maybe it'll get better, better next Today's going to be great. <laughs> okay. I don't know what that means, but. I don't either. Well, hmm. We do have the Guardians of the Galaxy premiere later. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe y'all can do it in a the theater. Oh, yeah. No? The back oh. row. What do we mean like that? Seat. In the theater. You've never done that before? Yeah. No. Huh. What about in the car in the parking lot? Yeah. No. You've never done it in the movie theater. I, I've done it in the car in the parking lot before okay. when we first started dating. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Now you have a luxury vehicle to do it. So, yeah. <laughs> but it's smaller, so, yeah. Uh, hers isn't. Mm. No, hers would be nice. Yeah. yeah. Lay down the back seat. You yeah. stand up in hers. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Y'all can run around <laughs> in that one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is it more depressing that we're helping because you know it's not going <laughs> to... A little bit, yeah. Because everything we're saying, like, you could do it on the right side of the bed. It's like, yeah, I know I could, but we won't. So we're just making it worse at this point. It's got to be quick. All right. (laughs) (laughs) It's got to be quick regardless. I'm like, I I know, like, are you gaslighting me on that, too? Because I know I'm quick. (laughs) (laughs) I can't help it. You don't have to tell me. I already know that I'm quick. (laughs) The reason why I'm quick is because it's like, oh, my God. I've had this forever. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like any movie you watch and they sh- they bring out somebody and they've been like in a cave or something and yeah. they haven't eaten and they're like, blah, 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 and they're eating like crazy. Mm-hmm. I get it. Yes. So you've been, you're starving at that point I sexually. Mean, not to get mm-hmm. too personal. It's too late. <laughs> We're <for> here. <laughs> but like, it was so long since the last time. It was like weeks that I, I I'm pretty confident that when it was, when I kind of came over there to the side of the bed where she was on. Uh-huh. I was only there for about 28 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> you could I respect even, the honesty. Yeah, yeah, I, I respect the honesty. I do honest. too. Yeah, yeah, I do too. Now you have, yeah. more We've frequently, all been I can, you know, but sure. I think it was 28 seconds. Nice. It's like your tolerance when you take a look at the tea break. You, you, yeah. yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. It, it's exactly right. It's when you have it. <laughs> it's like when you're starving yes. to death and that saltine cracker tastes like a. Uh, Lobster. <laughs> <laughs> That's how fast. Oh, you didn't even round up to 30 seconds. Straight up 28. Yeah, 28, 28, 28 baby. Okay. 28. Yeah. About 20. I don't think it hit 30. Okay. Yeah. But did she say make it quick? Originally, she said... I guess if it's gonna be quick. Oh, that's so hot. But yeah, <laughs> so right. Hot. Yeah. But, yeah, that's okay. But I mean, and but you know, for it the happens. record, she was just a short. Oh, oh so you, oh. you yeah. accomplished the goal. But did she have... Yes, machinery. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh. Which I think is a lot better than me, apparently. So <laughs> yeah, well, of the course. Machinery is unfair for me. <laughs> the robots are taking over yeah. <laughs> every <laughs> aspect. <They're Yeah>. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right. Oh, we all just pictured you guys doing it. Right. We did. Oh, yeah. I did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was nice. I just, <laughs> I just picture like a cutaway in a TV show. Twenty-eight seconds later. <laughs> <laughs> Back on his side of the bed. On the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hit the garage again? <laughs> You're back to normal life. <laughs> Jay's is back on his side of the bed, and in the distance, you just hear. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, Matt. <laughs> Carol, the decibels are too loud. I'm in the room with you. My beater's going crazy. <laughs> what are you doing in there? No, no, no. I'm, I'm dust trying busting. to research hot top chemicals. <laughs> <laughs> the oils. <laughs> no, no, it's a yeah, dust buster. But like yes. in all seriousness, we're sad for you. You don't, you don't have to be. Oh, okay. We're not saying anymore. <laughs> I'm over it. All right, and uh, Kevin Costner, just real quick. Yes. Kevin Costner uh, is saying he's blindsided That's what by he's the saying. divorce and also denying any rumors of infidelity. And mm. also saying done after season five. Yep. Man. Mm-hmm. And another report did come out today saying part of the strain was she wanted him to quit Yellowstone. Okay. Well, and now he's going to, and it's like, eh, never mind. Well, he has that other four installment project yeah. that he took on that's going to take 500 years. And I heard he's... Uh, been seen out with Pete Davidson dating. So that's <laughs> <a new thing. laughs> right. 